when you want the truth, and when you want the facts, you better watch no filter, because I got your back, ain't no ducking, ain't no dodging, ain't no scheming, ain't no hiding, cause I got that work, you wanna get this work, you wanna get this work, you about to get this work. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to No Filter News and Talking. It's your girl, Ingrid. Welcome back. The queen is here. The queen is here. <laughs> no, but seriously, I am back. <laughs> but listen, y'all, I've just been busy. Do not beat me up. Do not fight me. I've been busy just doing some things around my house. And listen, I will be coming out with a DIY channel real soon. So look out for that. If you're into that type of thing, make sure you subscribe. If not, keep it pushing. Okay? I want to send a big shout out to all my subs, all my new subs. Oh, wow. You guys, like, really, really love me. I love you guys, too. So, big shout out to y'all. Y'all still subscribing, even if I'm not even putting out videos. It's like y'all want the real. And welcome to my channel. When you want the real, when you're seeking that truth, I'm here to give it to you. As best I know how. Now let's jump into this video, shall we? Now, okay, I'm one thing about me is I like to stay on topic. I don't want to go 50,000 different places. I'm not going down no yellow brick road to trying to find the truth when the truth is already in the beginning. I respect people craft. I love how people look at different angles. I respect that. I love that. Because you know what? I learned a lot from a lot of people. But over here on this channel, I like to keep it at the beginning. You know, let's just stay right here. Because if this was anybody else besides Nipsey Hussle, guess what we would say? Who was he with? That, that would be the question we would ask, right? And we'll be trying to figure out who was he with? And these different people who was around at the time of the shooting. And that's what we need to do. We need to stick to the topic. And find out who was he with. Because there was a lot of people there. And the truth is slowly but surely coming out. Oh, it really is. Some things had just fell into my lap. Or should I say my DM? Now this picture right here. This kind of was given to me. And big shout out to my subs. And you know who you are. Like you are the real MVP. I appreciate you. I really want you to know that. Now this picture is of a guy. Who said he was at the Marathon store. March the 24th. Okay. He has this on his page. Boom. This is what he's saying. March the 24th. As you can see, look at the floors. Look at the floors. The floors is intact. So now we got the 25th, 26th, 27th, 28th, 29th, 30th, 31. Seven days later, Nipsey was killed. But I want y'all to look at March 24th. He was saying that he just took a picture. Or did he? But anyway, he just took a picture and he said that, and he said that the marathon continues. Hmm. That's it. That's all he said under the picture was the marathon continues. Even on March the 24th. I don't know about y'all, but I'm talking about as for me, I hadn't even heard that slogan until after Nipsey had passed. So why would he say the marathon continues? It's just really weird to me. That's that's kind of odd. Like I said, I hadn't even heard that slogan until the 31st. You know, and then people were saying the marathon continue. Actually, after that, because when Lauren Thur when Lauren London, I'm sorry, when she said it at the at the funeral, she was like, and the marathon continues. You remember she said that? That's when that slogan kind of got popular. So March the 24th, this is what he said, but whatever. 
I'm just saying, it it sounds really strange to me. <laughs> but I could be wrong. I could be wrong, but let's keep it pushing. So this chick right here claimed that she was in the marathon store on March 31st with her and her and another girl whom I didn't just post a picture of, but I have it. So she claimed that she was at the marathon store with them, but the jury is still out on the actual day she was there. The reason why I say that is because on all her social media accounts, it clearly says March 31st, right? And then she has an edited caption. And the caption reads, let's take it there. The caption reads, it says, hold up. It says, we were literally just the only customers at his store waiting, geeked, ready to see him. How did this happen? Seriously, y'all. We could have got hit. We just pulled off. Big prayers to Nipsey. This is what she says on her Facebook page. Right? On her Facebook page. And it's posted March 31st in Los Angeles, California. Okay, now let's, let me take you somewhere else. I'm going to take you to her Instagram account. Okay? Now, she posted the same pictures, and she said in her caption right here, she says, We were inside the Marathon store waiting on Nipsey to come in there, waiting on Nipsey to come in there with his cool-ass employees, buying shit. We pulled away from the store 15 minutes before he was taken away. That could have been us. I'm so pissed it was him. God bless his family and at Lauren London and their children. Now, which one was it? Was you waiting on him? Or did you pull away? You were in the store waiting on him to come in the store. Which one was it? This is where her caption reads. Something totally different from what her Facebook read. This is her Instagram and her Facebook. Now they both say March the 31st, right? But watch this. Peep this. So, well, when did this get posted? Because I showed y'all this was one of the girls who was with her. Who she claimed was with her. This says April 1st. And, and the floors is all toe up. But on her social media accounts, she now it now says that she was there on March 31st. Which one was it? Because that timing, that date, is crucial as hell. Okay? Which one was it? You claim you was waiting on him? And he was in there talking to his cool ass employees but then you pulled away now this is why it seems so fishy to me because we know from certain footage that Nipsey was standing outside any logical person unless you just really gotta go any logical person if you were waiting on him to come in and he was outside, wouldn't you go out there? If you had to go anyway, wouldn't you go out there and see him? Or, you know, what's the deal? Wouldn't you go out there and just, hey, Nipsey, how you doing? Can I get a picture? I gotta go. I was waiting for you to come in, but I, can, can I get a picture? You know, I, I hate to interrupt you, but oh my God, I'm so happy. I, I, I see you, you know, I'm from, I'm all the way from Oklahoma. Can I take a picture with you? That's any logical person. You said you were waiting for him to come in, but then you left. 15 minutes. You left, and 15 minutes later, he was shot down. That's what I'm talking about. See why I say we can't get far from the truth? The truth is right there in our face. She, so from what, from what her social media accounts are saying, she's a liar. She's a liar. 
I was wondering, during Cowboy's testimony, according to the transcripts, I was wondering why that prosecutor kept pointing out the women who was out there at that time. Go back. I need y'all to go back. Go back and listen to it and read it. I'm going to do it in my next, in, in another video. I'm going to go back over it. Or you can go, actually, I have a video. It's called Cowboy's Testimony. Go listen to it. I was wondering why the prosecutor kept saying, like, you know, you see this woman, you see that woman, this woman is, you know. I was wondering why the prosecutor kept pointing out, like, certain women. Because these women was there. And they was placed there. I was wondering why they kept saying Oklahoma, Oklahoma. In my comment section, they was talking about different people that were from Oklahoma. And I'm like, why they keep saying that? Uh-huh. So they was all there from Oklahoma. Now it's confirmed that we got people from Oklahoma that came to the Marathon store on March 31st. On March the 31st, or is it April 1st? See how they trying to throw people off? You can't throw us off. Because we on your heels. So, now, this is what I find odd. Now, hold up. Now, she got, on both of her social media accounts, she has... Um, she don't really say nothing about the reason of her being in California. You know, yeah, it's none of my business. But I'm just saying, you post that you there, normally a normal person is going to tell why they there. She's got a picture of her, and I think she thinks she was looking good this particular day. But she says, looking good should be a sin. You should call me cinnamon. Hashtag Kelly Behavior. Hashtag Miss Powell. At Los Angeles, California. This is what she says. Okay. So then, the post after that, that's when she posts this picture and say, Oh, we was just literally there. Now, after that, she don't say nothing else about Nipsey until it's his birthday. She don't talk about nothing. If you were just there with somebody, a big famous person that's got killed, I mean, you would be traumatic, you know. You'll be traumatized, you know. And you, you, you almost will keep posting about it and talking about it like, oh, my God, y'all. I'm just, she don't say nothing. She promoting her, hold up. She promotes herself being on the radio. She don't say nothing else about Nipsey. Until it's his birthday. You see what I'm saying? The suspects be right there in our face. You're a suspect, sweetie. There's nothing else you can say. You're a suspect. So when I jump into her DM. And I asked her. I said, you know, I got a few questions. About the murder of Nipsey Hussle. She don't say nothing. She don't say anything. Huh. But you clearly own there and you seen my stuff. You seen what I DM'd you, but you're on there and you posting. You see what I'm saying? A suspect. Now we know that Higgle these floors. Higgle these floors again, this was after he got killed. You know they pulled everything up. So, when were you there? She said she was in there with his cool ass employees with an S. This is what she says. And I find that real strange. But then the dates on her social media accounts are changed. It goes from... March the 31st to April the 1st. I'm just trying to make sense of it. If I keep repeating myself, my bad. I just be trying to make sense of certain things. And they don't make sense. It just clearly doesn't add up. Now, somebody in the comment section, when she posted, you know, looking good should be a sin. When 
out in these Cali streets or whatever, when somebody posted that, when, when she posted that, I'm sorry, then people had asked her, I'm listening to something and something bothering me, but anyway, when people had asked her, oh, are you, are you in California promoting your hair, you know, doing your hair stuff, she never responds. Quite naturally, you would tell why you there. Because you posted it. If you don't want nobody to know, you wouldn't be there. See, somebody sent them people there to kill Nipsey, to distract Nipsey, to rob Nipsey. Something happened. Was they dropping something off? Something happened. But they came by the boatloads. Oh, they came by the boatloads. It was quite a few people that was there at the time of his death. That's what I'm saying. Why none of these names are on the transcripts? They claim they couldn't get in contact with nobody? Y'all couldn't get in contact with nobody? It's time for them. They should have been subpoena, you know, sending subpoenas out to several different people. If I could find out who these people is, what is the FBI doing? What what are they doing? These people are suspects. You wasn't just happen to be there. You wasn't just happen to be there. Oh no. No. You was placed there for a reason. But you were in there waiting for him. You were in there waiting for him to come in. But then you left. So, sis, did you leave out the back door? Because wouldn't you have to pass him to leave? I mean, if he was standing right here, like somebody was clearly filming. If he was standing right here, then you had to walk past him to leave. What are you saying, sis? See, if you listen to a person, they tell off on themselves. They do it all the time. So what is she saying? Yeah, suspect. Her and her girls. Big suspect. Her name Wendy Powell. Oklahoma. She does hair. Y'all mess with the wrong king. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. And that's my time. Tell me what y'all think in the comment section. Hmm. Bye-bye.